What's up, everybody? And Bush Garden Junkie here, and my wife is uh, window shopping. So, you know what? I want to give a good shout out to the 91 subscribers I got out there. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you for subscribing. And guess what? We got some great news for you. Yeah, you see her right behind me. She's doing a, well, yeah. We got some important information. Stay tuned. And if you want more content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Turn It Up is back at the Moroccan Palace, peoples. Yep, the hottest show on ice. Come see it. Nice new paint job. Sounds a little squeaky, but hey, that could be because it's wet. It makes it a lot better. While we're over here, we're gonna take a look at the event calendar for 2022. Currently going, we have the Real Music Series going till February 27th and Mardi Gras to March 6th. Uh, we also have the Kids Weekends going from actually the end of January to February 13th. The Food and Wine Festival starts in March, ends in May, then Cinco de Mayo. Viva la Musica! And of course, summer nights. Beer fest, of course. Hello screen. And uh, something that looks new. A bush garden spooktacular. Might be for the kitties. And the always. Wonderful. Christmas town. <gasps> Look at that. You guys see that too. Opening March 11th. Yeah. Can't see her anymore. But yeah, March 11th, guys. Opening date for Iron Wazi. Now, um, if you watch my videos, you also seen that um, there was a, a special Passport to Thrills VIP. And, well, at the end of the year, I get an email saying that my wife and I, the junkies that we are, we visited seven times and we were eligible for the Passport to Thrills VIP. And uh, many of you, by the time you're watching this, you probably have already gotten your email to RSVP. And, uh, well, we have our date. February 11th, Friday, between 10 and 11, we are going to be one of the first riders. Yeah, they had uh, Rocky Mountain Construction riding it. Um, of course, they had to ride it because they built it. Uh, then they had some other people ride it, the CEO ride it. They, about a month or two ago, they did a commercial shooting and they had riders there. And I'm very jealous to some people who shall not be named for riding it like 24 times during the commercial shoot. You know who you are. So we're uh, are ready to ride it. We've been waiting two long years. Yes, she's been delayed for two years. Let's let's go ahead and give her a nice hip hip hooray for opening. 
before we ride Cheetah Hunt, we actually got to go ahead and see a live Cheetah. Hi. Nice new paint job. And happy riders. Now, the Bush Gardens has been going through a lot, a lot of refurbishment lately. So, uh, yeah, we'll see a lot of work walls here. Um, there's uh, some new painting going on at the entranceway. Montu, ooh, I, I just saw some nice bright yellow on Montu. Uh, Montu is getting refurbished. And also, I think it's also annual maintenance. So, but uh, yeah, let's see if I can get over here and zoom in on the nice new paint job on Montu. Oh, no, that is zoomed in. But you see that top one right there? That top bar. Yeah, paint job is coming along. And if you look through there, well, we'll take a walk up there and take a look at it a little bit later, but we're gonna hop on Cobra's Curse right now with a wait time of five minutes. Five minute wait time. So on our wrap sheet, let's see what we got. Pretty good, it's going great. You see Montu's new colors? Yes, I know. <laughs> Making note of that for all the uh, followers I got there. She's looking pretty, just like Cheetah Hunt looked pretty. Yeah, so. Okay, well, you can go. It says now, because it's only five minutes. Thank you. And uh, because of the scooter there, we go through the quick queue lane because it gives us access to the ADA loading section of Cobra's Curse. This is the only ride, it's a very unique loading for ADA. So, I mean, transfer is like very easy if you're in a wheelchair or in a scooter. But being that that is the quick you, we don't get to see a lot of the other stuff that's on the other side of this wall. You saw how that train just went from in there to out there. Hello, hi. Just the two of us. Just the two, okay. Yeah. But it looks like you already have one already just swapped over. So I guess we'll wait till this one comes back. Yeah. 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 They're just gonna go right around. <laughs> huh? You wanna pull that and park it in here? Whoa! Brakes, lady brakes. So we will wait over here on this side until they come back. 
transfer, okay? You can transfer, okay? Yeah. Right. Is it? Yeah. Now this is the ADA train that has left before. It is train number four. I don't think we've ever been on train number four before. So we'll watch as this train comes back in. It'll stop right there. And the cool thing about it is this track moves. He's got a what? He's got a little RFID reader over there, and he's got to do certain things over there. But yeah, the train moves over here, and they offload, and we onload. So we are on the ADA train now. There's a real track, and here's the ADA track underneath us. <laughs> really? What? You that cold? Yes. Okay, it's like 55 degrees and... Well, consider the wind and the rain gets even colder. It's not that cold. Oh. Yeah, okay. And here we move. See this? Yeah, I like that name. <laughs> you new here? No, no, I've been watching for about a year. Ah. That's why I haven't seen you in the. You're in the booth though, mainly. Nice ride. Doing great. Cold. Yeah. My hands are freezing. Don't mind her, she's always cold. <laughs> Alright, try to pull down your left part. My hands up. Alright, so. A little wet, a little 
cold. And we are riding Cobra's Curse. Yep. We're going to see how well this one spins. You never know. Yep. You think we can escape the Cobra's Curse? Now what? I don't know. I can't see the lights. One of the sensors say it wasn't ready. Yeah, okay. And here we go again. Ooh, that's a cold breeze. Uh, narration was missing. And elevator go up. Yeah. While we're up here, we get a good look at Monty's new paint job. Look at that yellow. Beautiful, isn't she? You are mindful. Oh, the animals are hiding. Whee! And then we go backwards. I think the people behind us spun a lot. <laughs> Let's see. We'll be, there's another track there. And we'll be going over here. Please leave the front of that bar, watch your step, and exit to your left, taking all personal belongings with you. Thank you. Might need to get out and push it that way. <laughs> there we go. Ching ching. And that is it. Yeah, this is as close as we can get, guys. I'm sorry, because there is a barricade here, and all of Montu is closed off. I'm, I'm sure if I ask kindly, maybe he might let me go in a little closer. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, no, didn't think so. Sorry, YouTubers, can't get any closer, but we're close enough. Still got a lot of work to do. She'll be closed for at least another month. Uh, but yeah, she's getting a nice little work over just like Cheetah Hunt did. And she's looking great. We miss you, Montu. Uh, crowd levels look typical for a Saturday. Yeah, Cheetah Hunt is not quite up to two hours yet. It's only up to 60 minutes. Um, it is 51 degrees. 
and yeah, cloudy, drizzly, feels damp in the air, but uh, yeah, so looks like pretty much normal crowd levels. Moya or Akita is definitely enjoying the water. Probably because it's a lot warmer than the air. I just checked the temperature, folks. It is 51 degrees out there. So, yeah. I would stay in the water if it's warmer, too. In the jungle, the mighty jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. Ah, look at them. They actually both looked at me when I started singing. They're like, please give it up. Stick to your daytime job. There's something she's chewing on back there. Now that this area's cleared up. Hi. Aww. Hello. <laughs> Drinking water off of the... There's some more back in there. Yeah, there's another one right there. And then... Hi! A couple more babies. They really cleared up this area nice and clean so that way we can actually see these guys. Mm -hmm. And uh, just across the way from the Nialas, we have the Thompson Gazelles, which are all over there. And ooh, now the question is: Is that a real or a fake owl? Did you see that owl over there? Sitting up on the top? That's not real. That's makes, not real. Makes me wonder. And there goes Sheeta Hunt. I think it is. It looked like it it's moved. There we go. No, just, just perfect. You're good. You'll be on YouTube if you stay in. <laughs> We're here at the Serengeti Outposts, and here's where you can get all the tours, and I definitely highly recommend all of them. They're all great. Uh, if you follow my channel, We've been on the tortoise tour. We went on the penguin tour. We went on the animal ambassador and cider tour. And we also did the hippo tour. And, uh, well, it's not listed there, but the Serengeti tour, which is right there. Thank you. <laughs> no, Billy's not here, but Coda's here. Hi, Coda! <laughs> so, yes, definitely highly recommend it if you get a chance. These tours are wonderful tours, and you get to meet people like Coda. 
Coda is actually doing the boys tour, the, the tortoise tour. We call them, we call them the boys. Good old uh, <laughs> Jim and uh, uh, Jim and Bubba. Yeah, our favorite boys. Yeah. <laughs> While we do come here for the rides, we also come here for the animals, and well. Even though it's a little wet today, we gotta stop by and visit our good old animal uh, elephant friends over here. Actually, the smell isn't too bad today. Maybe we gotta get up a little closer, but we'll go ahead and stop right here and take a good look at them. Oh, and I gotta clean the lens again. Sorry, folks. Hi there. Coming into Pantopia and Falcon's Fury just went up. People are on it. And it's only a five minute wait. And yeah, that sound means that they came down. We're going to go ahead and get on it. Why not? Especially with only a five minute wait. Is this the same? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's just scary coming down a little bit. Yeah, I'm looking. Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we do too. I brought one. Wow. Uh, train's creating a lot of smoke over there by Shikra. That's a train. That's what I said. The train is creating a lot of smoke over there. Uh. Choo choo! <laughs> and there's a the train! Yeah. Wow. It looks like junk out here. Man, you can't even see Tampa. No, can't see Tampa anymore. And yes, the lock room is running, but not, not that many people, people on it. Nope. <laughs> Yay! There's the ground, peoples. <laughs> ah! <laughs> that is cold. <laughs> oh, Bursky. <laughs> <laughs> that was cold. That was freezing. The last time we were here, the Tiger Trails was closed, so we're going to see if we can find any tigers. Over there. Uh, over there. A little walkway, I don't remember actually seeing that before being open like that. By the way, everybody is looking down there. Yeah, yeah it's down there. Went through the tiger trails, didn't see any tigers, but notice everybody looking down here, and right there he is, sleeping peacefully.
sold here, and then, like all day dining deals oh, sold here. Know. They're like, oh, I'm sorry. Wow. I was like, I'm not gonna spend for the the food. Go get all day dining pass, yeah. and then go eat everywhere else. Oh, wow. Yeah, no. yeah. I mean, we're, we're gonna get it. It was like nineteen dollars. There's another yeah. one up there. And there's another one up there. We were informed that the Gibbons area was reopened, so we're gonna go check that out now. Yeah. Does look like they opened up this area, but there is still work walls back here. Uh, I believe this is a kitty wet play area. That is not opened up. Yeah, toddler water play. Looks like they may have cleaned up this area a little bit. Like I said, they've been doing a lot of refurbishing. These are Northern white cheek gibbons. They come from Asia. Critically endangered. Hi. Hi. Aren't you the cutest things? You pop the cold as ever. Uh, I don't know, they get pretty thick fur. Yeah. Hi there. So yeah, if you look around, uh, their area definitely looks like it got a little bit of refurbishing. Please do not feed the gibbons. Now over here, this area is temporarily closed. <coughs> we got some duckies in here. some uh, well I'm not sure what they are they're not flamingos where there's oh those I didn't see them up there a whole bunch of them um, pink birdies Go get it. <sighs> and they got more fishies in here. Down in there. That seems about it. So that was the Gibbons area. We got Wild Surge over here. They're slowly opening up this area, but the uh, the treetops are still closed off. So 
Oh uh, yeah, all of the actual jungle stuff way up there. It's all closed down. And uh, yeah. And that was the Gibbons area. And they're slowly uh, refurbishing and getting things opened up. So should be nice and cleaned up pretty soon. As we leave Jangala, we come into Stanleyville. The sky ride is still closed, but it is it is scheduled to open up soon, guys. We have uh, the axe coming up. Uh, it's actually uh, let's hang on. Uh, yeah, I believe uh, we missed Eagle Mania. We did catch diamonds. Let's hang on. I don't know. All for one. Uh, Hollywood Nights, Dancing Dream, Ambrosia, and Simply Queen. Well, yeah, it's a shame we missed the Eagle Mania, but I don't think we want to miss Simply Queen. Yeah, amazing. 50 degrees. And they're still running the log flume. But yeah, I don't see anybody on it. Not a single person on it. Yeah, empty. Uh, who wants to go on this anyway? I don't think anybody wants to get wet and then be out in 50 degree weather. No, no. <laughs> Hello, Shikra. The Real Music Series is right here in Stanleyville. They usually have two shows, the one at 11.30 and one at 1.30. But this is where you get all the good music acts. And Tigra. And Shikra. Welcome to Stanleyville. Uh, we are on Shikra, even though it said it was shut down. Doesn't look like it's shut down to me. But Falcon's Fury does look shut down. We're just waiting for the train in front of us to get to a certain point and then we can go. See, the train is already up there. see Tampa looks like it's clearing up a little bit out there today just a little, just a little. Oh, but it's still cold man it is cold and breezy and this is gonna freeze our nose off
this and my face is frozen off. Uh, you know that's why we didn't even stop on the Yeah, I know. Not all the time, but yeah, and I had a drop of water hit me directly in the middle of the forehead. <laughs> Spring is not that far away. Even though it's only 50 degrees, well, it's winter, it's January, and it's 50 degrees here. But we got the trees blossoming. It looks so pretty. They're nuts if they even want to get wet. Hi. So pretty. Hi there. I love the eyes and the beak. Yes, I do. Say hi to YouTube. No? Okay. <laughs> and along with the toucan, we also have the uh, red fronted macaws. One of them looks sleeping. They're both sleeping. One is preening. Hi there. And of course, we got all our lorikeet friends. Hi, lorikeets. Hi. Hi, Hi there. You hear them chirping all over the uh, yeah, there's one. Another one up there. There's like three of them hanging out over here. Hi there. Yeah, that was weird though that you came to me. Oh, look at this nice brown one. Yeah. Look, take your finger, okay, right on their belly. You go right on their belly. <laughs> Hi guys. Little guy is having fun over here. 
Yeah, this is duck weather. Duck season. Duck weather, not duck season. <laughs> if any season, it's wabbit season. Duck right? Season. Wabbit season. Duck season. Wabbit season. Okay. Enough Elmer Fudd. <laughs> Hi. Hi there. Hi. Ha ha ha. Did you come here? No. Come on. No. You, you really think that hurts? You really think that hurts? Hey, buddy, I got a whole bunch of birds at home that do the same thing. It don't hurt. No. Hi. You can say hi to them. Yeah, say hi to all the people. Hi. Hi. Say hi to all the people on YouTube. No, you're not looking at them. <laughs> what are you trying to trick me? What? Look at him, look at him. That's water. He's trying to trick me, kid. <laughs> Yeah. It's the attack of the birds. I know. We gotta find another one. I don't think they brought the pheasant back over here yet. No. So. Hello. Hi. And that's it. I don't know what's up with these. They're quite active. And those seem to be quite boring. Well, I don't know. But then again, all they are is pink chickens. They could be active because it's cold and they want to warm up. Oh, now they quiet it down. Okay. Don't get it. Some of them still have their necks straight up, and those over there still look like they're sleeping. Mardi Gras is in full effect. Start off with a few of the duckies. And of course the seagulls. Yeah. Pain in the butt. Uh, they do have an Australian tour. It looks like it's going on.
little things. Good question. Hello, old friend. <laughs> Hi there. You're so pretty. Yeah, you are. I like the green beak. Yeah. <laughs> Moving right along. Yeah. Our swan is still sitting on the fake eggs. We're not going to have any more baby swans. They are fake eggs. This little guy. <laughs> that little one right there. Yeah. Well, that's a kangaroo and that's, and that's a wallaby. A, yeah. Chase him down. Chase him down. <laughs> oh, you scared him. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Hi! And then pink eyes. Well, they're hard to keep clean. Yeah. Hey, little guy. Aww. You got an itch? And another white one over here. Would Mardi Gras be without a whole bunch of beads? Well, actually, I don't see the beads anymore. Oh, uh, there they are! And playing is a rusty right band. And this area is a little crowded.
was gonna get some close-up shots of Iron Gwazi from back there, but the festival walkway um, is closed. I thought it would have been open for Mardi Gras, but you can see her back there. And right there, That is going to be one wild ride, that's for sure. Yep, it is. A couple of years ago, that sign used to say opening March of 2020. But yeah, you saw that date, March 11th. The work walls are still up. But just another couple of weeks. Well, February 11th. Uh, I think that'll be doing it for us for today. It is cold, but we got to ride on every single ride that we wanted to that was open. Um, Montu is currently closed, they're going through renovations. Shikra will be closing at the end of this month. Iron Gwazi is going to be opening up soon. But, uh, yeah. I don't know what happened there, but as I was doing that video, it kind of was a little bit interrupted because there was people. Um, well, that person looks like he's got some gear on, so he was probably climbing on the lift. Uh, they're probably checking the track over and and everything, but uh, yeah, February 11th uh, between 10 and 11 o'clock we'll be going on this. Um, but as I was saying before, uh, yeah, we're going to close this out today. It is uh, very cold, and we did get to ride every ride we wanted to ride on, and. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll give this uh, a little wait see and see if they're gonna run any uh, a test run maybe, who knows. Uh, I didn't see anybody go up to the control booth yet. I might. I'm going to keep on rolling this. We'll just edit some of it out. Okay. Not sure who that was, but that was one of the ride operators giving us a thumbs up. Not sure exactly what that's supposed to mean. Oh, we saw some people looking like they were going into the control booth of Iron Gwazi, but we waited a little bit. They weren't doing any test runs or anything, probably just training. So we will definitely call it a day. We got to ride, like I said, ride all the rides we wanted to ride on that were open. Um, Montu closed, Shikru will be closing at the end of the month. And uh, well, we just had a grand old time having fun. We are now heading out and uh, going to enjoy ourselves and try to stay warm. <laughs> yeah, it's cold. Catch you next time. Later, everybody, and thank you for all the 91 subscribers. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button.
and may be difficult, but hey, you may have to sign up with an email address or something, but it's well worth it. You get content like this all the time. As we're leaving, I noticed, uh, well, the Moroccan Palace definitely looks a lot better. And this Nairobi gate looks like it got fixed up. Some uh, new paint job here. Yeah, they're doing a lot of goodies. Say goodbye to Bush Gardens for now. We'll see you again.